Welcome to this Windows and Computer channel and uh, this is another video where we're going to give you a little bit of tips and tricks if you are unable to upgrade to the May 2004 version or 2004 or the May 2020 update. Um, so one of the weirdness of the upgrade block and a lot of you have said that the upgrade went through after you did that was to remove OneDrive from your computer. And I see in the comments that a lot of you have finally upgraded with removal of OneDrive. Go figure and don't ask me, but you know, sometimes there's some weird things happening for sure. Now this one is about upgrading with the media creation tool. A lot of people are trying to upgrade via the media creation tool and they get an error message that says that it can't install the upgrade to Windows 10 and that it rolls back to your previous install. Um, from what I see in most of the situations, it is due to something that is installed or not installed on your PC. Uh, first thing to check is antivirus. Are you using a third-party antivirus rather than using the uh, standard uh, Windows Defender? or Windows Security. If you are using anything else than Windows Security, um, one of the first things that you could try is remove the antivirus completely from your machine and then go and use the media creation tool and try to upgrade to your, um, your version of Windows 10. That is the first thing that you should try. Uh, apparently, a lot of people, when they remove their third-party antivirus, they uh, actually have the upgrade process goes well. It seems that some third-party antiviruses might actually cause a conflict with the upgrade process. Once the upgrade is done, and once you are on the May 2020 update, if you want to reinstall it, you just reinstall it. You go back to your mad to the company where you are manufacturer of the software and you know the antivirus maker, and just download and reinstall it after and it's going to be fine. Another uh, big problem that I've seen uh, once again is the fact that a lot of the drivers are outdated in a lot of PCs. So make sure that you go to the manufacturer of your computer and that you update the drivers for everything that is possible to update. Uh, that first of all can create an update block, meaning that through Windows Update you don't see the version 2004. But also, if uh, you were using the media creation tool, well, that might actually fix the problem. And last but not least, the BIOS of your machine. If you have a recent computer, remember that your computer has a uh, BIOS and that it needs to be updated from time to time. It's not something that people usually do. And so it might require that update to the BIOS. Once again, for that, go to the manufacturer of your computer online and check out all the updates that are available, including BIOS, and install them to make sure that you have the latest versions of everything. Uh, this apparently is another reason why Windows 10 might not be able to update uh, because it doesn't have, you know, your hardware isn't updated to the latest software and, 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 and different uh, firmware. So these are a few tips and tricks. And, uh, of course, if all um, fails, you can, of course, try and do a clean install if you do wish to get it on your PC. And, of course, I will always give my recommendation of wait for it to arrive if you don't see it through Windows Update. There's no real big rush to move on to the May 2020 update. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us a thumbs up. Thank you for watching.